Greetings, friends. Today I'm going to be talking about this receiver for our Dovo laser level. The laser level we've re reviewed in a past video. I'll put a link in the description to the past video. Um, this the, the actual laser level is an H3360G. And the receiver, what the receiver is designed to do, and this is the model DR1. This is the actual receiver. And oftentimes in bright sunlight, it's very difficult to see the laser line. I'll turn this on so you can kind of see the what the laser lines look like. So that's kind of what the laser lines and we're inside here so you know it's not hard to see inside but if you're out in the bright sunlight and you have a, a measuring stick which we do have for our transit then it can be difficult to see so the way this device works is it picks up the laser line from the laser level here and it when you hit center it beeps and tells you so this right here has two different settings on this button. One is three millimeters and the other is one millimeter. The three millimeters would be used for if you're a long ways away and you're just trying to pick up the line. And then if you want to get more accurate, then you'd go down to the one millimeter setting. And this side has a sound where you can turn up the sound or turn I guess it's turn off or turn up the sound. And it also has a level, so you can tell when you're holding the device level. And again, you can read what you're doing from the back side while you're holding it this direction. Okay. So this device, the receiver has a working range of five to 50 meters. And I believe that'd be if you're using another brand other than the Dovo laser level. If you use the Dovo H3 level, this will pick up up to 400 feet, and we're going to test that in a little bit. So another nice feature is it has a clip that you can attach this to. And when you do that, the, you can clamp this to the side of a, a pole, or in this case, we have a transit stick for height. We'll be attaching it to this. Yeah. this. This has a nice magnet on it, so if you want to set it on a metal piece, it will hold there. I'll show you. So, that's a nice feature. This is going to make our life a lot easier when we're working because before we really strained to pick up the laser line and bright sunlight it's kind of a cloudy day today but we're still going to go out and test this if you use this receiver with a other brand of laser level the pulse setting on the alternate brand has to be set to 10 kilohertz just wanted you to know that so don't buy a, if you plan on using this receiver don't buy a laser level that doesn't have a pulse setting. So as you can see, it's partly cloudy today. Just had a train come in. So Lori's gonna take off and step off, probably out close to the splitter there, the blue splitter. And we'll see if this thing will pick it up out that distance and she'll, it won't be an exact measurement, but she'll step off a yard at a time. And we'll know how many feet we're away. All right, so I'm about 200 feet away, we decided, because um, I could go farther back, but um, just for the sake of the video so you can hear it starting to beep so as the arrows point up it means i need to go higher as it goes down it means i need to there it is right there so that's up a little more it's hard to hold it still 
So you can hear it makes a steady sound when it's actually right there. If I was resting it on something, it'd probably be easier, but yep, that's how it works. So we're going to be putting down a wood floor that'll be probably 20 by 28. What Lori's doing right now is checking the height of the sand that we'll be putting the treated lumber down on. So she checked that spot. Then we're checking to see how far off we are from the original. So what we're trying to do here is determine what are we going to use as our height. And then each treated two before that we put down that the flooring will sit on will have to be at that same height. That way we'll be sure the floor is level all throughout the 20 by 28 area. We have the two outside two befores. They're treated, laid down on the moisture barrier. And Lori is measuring the height with a Delvo laser level and receiver. She just said it's really close. So we'll check in various areas. She said that one's really good. I'm right there. She said perfect. While the camera was off, we did do a little bit of adjusting. We put sand under this, so if we need to go down, we're just taking a uh, sledgehammer, tapping down on it, and it seems to level out nicely that way. So Lori's going all the way across. We're putting these boards 16 inches on center, and she's checking to make sure that they're pretty close to the same height all the way across with the Delvo receiver and laser level. A little high there too, huh? Okay, we can pound down on it. Okay. Got a few that we need to take the sledgehammer and pound down on them a little. We got the first three rows of flooring down. And the Dovo receiver made it faster. You can quickly determine your height. Where I can see this having the biggest advantage, and I probably mentioned it earlier, was outside when it's really bright. We'll definitely be using this on all of our building projects. I rate this top notch in terms of a valuable tool. So thanks for watching.